Well, as long as I've been interested in gears, I've been curious about how to make prime number gears. And this is the bad boy that got me started on all this. Um, I wanted to make a 37 tooth gear without actually having a 37 tooth gear. That involves making a differential. And I promise I'll explain the math, but I wanted to spend a little bit of time with the construction of the differential system uh, that I came up with for my hobby machine. Uh, if you spend any time at all on this channel, you'll learn to get used to my analog CAD, uh, which is a pencil and a piece of paper. Uh, it seems to be how I think. This is the sketch for the differential uh, that I created for my hobby machine. This is about iteration number four, but this is a, a system that places all three um, elements, all three major elements on a common axis. And that's what I've done. What follows is a description in pictures and videos for the construction process for the differential. There'll be more math later. I made the bevel gears according to the process shown in Gears and Gear Making by Ivan Law. Um, his example was a, a tiny bit confusing to me and I found a better one with a little more explanation on a website called, or a YouTube channel called LSCAD, which I highly recommend. Thank you. 
I don't mind telling you, I'm a little stoked about this. Still not quite complete, and I, for example, I don't have an output shaft yet, but um, this is working as it should. Well, I got into this whole deal because I like making gears. Good thing. I just counted them uh, for this particular setup, which is for 37 teeth. And there's 22 gears uh, in the whole setup, including the differential, the, the uh, index train, the differential gear cluster, and all of that. Well, this is the output gear train. Uh, for my differential, and I have to say this came out pretty nice. Very silky. Using double row ball bearings on both of the major axles. Well, 22 gears and a differential later, this thing's ready to run. I'm just idling along right now so I can uh, bask in the reflected glory, I guess. Anyway, I'm going to put a blank on this thing. It's Well, there it is, the 37 tooth gear. I promised math later, so I'm not gonna get into it now, but uh, it turns out there's a way better way to do it than what I just did. And uh, still uses the differential, and I'll explain all that in the next episode. Thanks so much for watching.